more warm weather around today and plenty more sunshine as well with one or two exceptions. Strong sunshine, UV levels will be high or very high and temperatures will respond, getting widely over 20 degrees Celsius across the heart of the UK. The question is sometimes asked, is there anything in life more beautiful than a young couple clasping hands and pure hearts in the path of marriage? Can there be anything more beautiful than young love? And the answer is given, yes, there is a more beautiful thing. It's the sight of an old man and an old woman finishing their journey together on that path. Their hands may be gnarled, but still clasped. Their faces may be seamed, but still radiant. Their hearts may be physically bowed and tired, but they're still strong with love and devotion to one another. Yes, there is a more beautiful thing than young love. It's old love. Welcome to this uh, beautiful occasion on this beautiful day, but special, of course, because it is the wedding day of Charlotte and Chris. Marriage is a way of life made holy by God and blessed by the presence of our Lord Jesus Christ with those celebrating a wedding at Cana in Galilee. Marriage is a sign of unity and of loyalty, which all should uphold and honour. Marriage enriches society and it strengthens community. No one should enter into it lightly or selfishly, but reverently and responsibly in the sight of Almighty God. Hi Charlotte, take you Christopher. To be my husband to be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In the presence of God, I make this vow. In the presence of God, I make this vow. Charlotte, I give you this ring. As a sign of our marriage. As a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. And all that I have, I share with you. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. Firstly, I'd like to turn your attention to a gorgeous lady sat next to me. I think you'll agree, Charlotte looks incredible today. My world and our world was turned upside down on 4th of August 2018. We had the greatest miracle in the world. Charlotte's been the most incredible with her, and 
I've been honoured to be there every step of the way. Good, bad, we've powered through together and Charlotte's been a pillar of strength throughout. I'm so proud of her and genuinely couldn't be happier right now. When I was asked by Sarah before her hen do, um, what I love most about her, that was actually quite a difficult question. So describing the love I have for like my best friend, my soulmate, and now wife is almost impossible. Simply seeing you walk down the aisle today, sort of look back and how amazing you looked and you look so happy. So many moons ago, I was sat with Mum and Martin around the kitchen table discussing the kind of guy I wanted to marry. Upon my exceptionally long list of non-negotiables <laughs> were um, must be close to family, must be well spoken, sporty and most importantly really fit. And I was like this guy absolutely does not exist. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. That is it. I'm dying alone. He doesn't exist. That is the end of discussion. Enter Chris Kirby. So, um... um but it was really when our little munchkin arrived that Chris became our superhero. There aren't enough words to describe how proud I am of you and just how thoughtful, funny, caring you are. Nothing is ever too much bother. When Benjamin becomes a dad, I know he'll be incredible because he's learned from the best. Life with you is just easy. The most boring of days are filled with so much laughter and love. You are so calm, so patient and so thoughtful. And the list just goes on. I always imagined and daydreamed of how I wanted my life to turn out, but I really never thought it would be this good. And thank you for making that happen. I love you. Aww. I consider myself the luckiest man um, to be married to such a wonderful woman and always will. I'll cherish every moment I spend with you and look forward to spending the rest of our lives together. So before the knock on the table comes <laughs> and before she changes her mind, um, can you please raise your glasses to my new wife, Charlotte. Charlotte. <laughs>